Search for Dr. Panda. Hey there, Mimi. You're off on a picnic with June today, aren't you? Awesome, you're all set to go. It's a perfect day for a fall picnic. Bright and breezy. Uh-oh. Better get inside, you two, or you'll get soaked. Looks like you'll have to postpone your picnic, guys. No worries. I'm sure you can find something else to do that's just as fun inside the house. Oh, looks like June's had an idea. What's that, June? An arts and crafts book? Perfect! You found something you can do inside and that can use up all the leaves that have blown in. Awesome! I wonder what that is. Daddy! Yes, Toto! Can you help Mei and June make a bird out of leaves? <laughs> Great! Let's go! First, we'll need to find the tail. It's a yellow oak tree leaf. Can you spot it? Yep, there it is! Yellow! Okay, so now we need to find a red maple leaf for the wings. Can you spot it? Well, that is red, but not a maple leaf, Maymay. A maple leaf is a different shape. You got it! That's the red maple leaf they need. Oops. It's looking good, guys. Now we need a green birch leaf for the head. Aww. We woke the squirrel from a nap. Oh, I guess that squirrel is awake now. That's a lot of green leaves. But remember, you need to match the color and shape. Can you see it? Yes! There it is! Good job! Now there's only one more leaf to find. An orange elm leaf for the beak. Awesome! Now all you need is a few sticks and chestnuts to finish it off! Whoa, that's a fine-looking bird! And I think it stopped raining, too, though it's still windy. Shame you haven't got a kite! Awesome! Your leaf bird makes a beautiful kite! Fun! Yep, have fun, guys! Are you guys ready to do something fun? Oh, oh yeah, Dr. P. I've got our best photos from over the year to put into our awesome friend scrapbook. All the photos are organized into different seasons in our scrapbook. We have pages for winter, spring, summer, and fall. All we need to do is figure out which photo belongs to which season. Can you help us put our photos on the right page of our scrapbook? Awesome! So in each picture, there's a clue that helps us work out which season it was taken in. Let's see if you can find the photo that belongs to the winter page. Can you see something in the picture that might be a clue? Hey, yes! But what kind of hat? Uh, a, a woolly hat! That's right, Bip! He needed it because last winter was really cold and snowy. Oh, yeah, I remember. <laughs> Let's find the photo we took in the spring. Can you see something in the picture that tells us it's springtime? It's sunny! Hey, yep! But it can be sunny in other seasons, too. So what else can you see that tells us it's spring? Flowers! That's right! Some flowers only bloom in the spring, like the tulips in this photo. Hmm. 
<laughs> Time to find the summer photo. What clue can you see that tells us it's summer? Uh, it's sunny? Yes! What else can we see that means it might be summer? Beach! That's right! The picture of you at the beach was taken in the summer! I remember! <laughs> Say cheese! Cheese! Ice cream! <laughs> <laughs> Let's find the fall photo. What happens in the fall that we can spot in the photo? Leaves change color? <laughs> That's right! <laughs> Green leaves change to red, yellow, and brown in the fall. Our scrapbook is finished. Not yet, Bip. There's one more photo from the fall. Oh, yeah. Halloween! <laughs> Sometimes you can remember things even without a clue. <laughs> <laughs> Toto, we've got some Christmas cards! Yay! Aw, oh, Toto, this is awesome! You've made a lovely collage with all these different shapes. <laughs> so what are you going to make now? Cards! <laughs> oh, you'd like to make some Christmas cards for our friends, would you? <laughs> sure thing, Toto! That's an awesome idea. All we need to do is find some shapes that are symmetrical so we can fold them into cards. Huh? <laughs> no worries, Toto. I'll show you. Symmetrical shapes are the same on both sides. And asymmetrical shapes are not the same on both sides. All we have to do is fold your shapes down the middle. Then we'll see whether they're symmetrical or asymmetrical. Ooh. The symmetrical shapes will make perfect Christmas cards. <laughs> Can you help Toto decide whether these shapes are symmetrical or asymmetrical? Awesome! Let's get folding! Let's fold the first shape. So, is this symmetrical? No. <laughs> That's right! This shape is asymmetrical. Let's try another one. Let's fold the second shape. What about this shape? Is it symmetrical? No. <laughs> yep, that shape is asymmetrical. Let's try the last shape. Is this a good shape for a Christmas card? Yeah! <laughs> right! That shape is symmetrical! Do you think you can work out which shapes you can use to make cards now? Yeah! Awesome! I'll come back and look at them when you're done. Oh, Toto, that's a lot of cards. And what an awesome design. <laughs> Hi there, 
here, June? <laughs> Toto and I came to see the Easter eggs you're painting. <laughs> oh, I see. You need help decorating the eggs because your glasses are all covered in paint. No worries, June. We'll be happy to paint the rest of your eggs. Did you want the last three eggs to be painted like the others? <laughs> okay, let's have a look at them. So, the first egg in each row has a blue star on it. The second egg in each row has a yellow smiley face on it. And the third egg in each row has a big red heart on it. Each row of eggs has the same patterns in the same order. So all we need to do is follow the pattern. Paint! Oh, hang on, Toto. We need to figure out which pattern to paint first. Can you help us figure out which pattern to paint on the first egg? Awesome! Let's get painting! Do we need to paint the first egg with a blue star, a yellow smiley face, or a red heart? Star! <laughs> That's right, Toto. The first egg in each row is painted with a blue star. So that's what we need to paint on our first egg. Awesome, Toto. Now, what do we need to paint on our second egg? A star, a smiley face, or a heart? Face! Yep, you got it, Toto. The second egg in the row needs to be painted with a yellow smiley face. <laughs> Great work, guys. Now, what do we need to paint on our third egg? A star, a smiley face, or a heart? Heart! Heart! That's right! The last egg in the row should be painted with a red heart. Oh, I think June would like to paint the last egg, Toto. Uh, I think your glasses still need cleaning, June. You've painted Toto instead of the egg. <laughs> heart! <laughs> Maybe you should paint that last egg after all, Toto. Ah, oh, those eggs look awesome. <laughs> Search for Dr. Panda. Stick around for more Toto Time episodes. And be sure to subscribe to our channel. Yay! <laughs>